world i'm back now this is um february the 14th it's valentine's day in the uk um and i'm not sure when this video is going to be aired because i'm still in the middle of doing my um beginners videos i'm not quite sure when they're going to end but i have some very exciting news to share with you all that in July, I have my own art exhibition in Bournemouth, which I'm really excited about. And it's running for two weeks at a gallery. I will put the details of the gallery down in the description. And I'm also taking part in a couple of festivals, art festivals this year. First one is in May, I'm um, a Dorset Arts Festival artist, which means my studio is open for two weeks for people to come and have a look around and see what I do. And it's part of an art trail in Dorset. So <laughs> I am gearing up to do some very big paintings for my art exhibition because particular space that there is um, will hold the biggest paintings that I've ever done. I'm going to keep those off YouTube for a while until it's all over um, because obviously if somebody wants to buy a painting it needs to be exclusive. So what I'm going to be doing is a series of tests for these big paintings and I'm going to record them, but I am not going to be doing a, a voiceover or tell you what I'm doing. I'm, I'm just, I just want to relax and um, just play. So therefore, these videos um, will just be small canvases. I won't be sure what I'll be doing. I'll have a rough idea. But I kind of figure I've done enough talking in recent videos, so it will just be background music. There won't be long videos, I will cut them down. And then the big paintings probably will be released later on in the year. I hope that's all okay. Um, but I will keep you all posted as to what, when. Follow me on Facebook um, for further details. So there you go. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoy this video.
Okay, um, I thought I'd just show you these. I, 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 I said at the beginning this was an experiment and um, I just want to pause here and, and talk about creativity in an acrylic pour. Um, and, and this was just me messing around. I These will go on the shelf. <laughs> Whether they'll see the light of day or not, I don't know. But every now and then, you know, it's not just about the techniques. If you want to progress as an artist, you need to find your own style. You, you need to find that thing that makes you, you. It's all very well copying other people and ring pours, straight pours, swipes. You know, go for it. Um, nail these down, nail these techniques down. But then after that, you know, you you, you need to start experimenting. And then every now and then I get a bit fed up. So I just start experimenting and they're cheap canvases. Um, and I'll just use leftover paint. This isn't particularly good, but I'll keep going and, and just try and make something of it. Um, there is some, um, uh, and this has been on my mind for ages and trying to make it work. The cells that I get with my black paint are, are quite unique shapes. Um, don't ask me why. It might be something to do with the background I use, different consistencies, don't know. But they they lend themselves to these pretty groovy trees that you... Th I don't know what, I'm going to look up the name. Okay, I haven't looked up the name. I should have looked up the name of them before I did this. But you see these big fat trees in Africa, big fat tree stumps that that go wide at the bottom and narrow at the top. And it was just, I was just inspired by those. So, but the thing is with, I'm an artist. I'm not just a fluid artist. And there's always that element of originality that's needed. You know, and you can look at a painting and think, well, I really don't like that, but it's completely original. And that is what people look for. That is what buyers look for, is originality in art. So these, I'll probably carry on working with this, put some highlights on the trunks and just, I'll put it away for a couple of days. I'll look at it and think, is it worth salvaging? But I just wanted to show you that or encourage you, experiment. Spend a day experimenting with leftover paint. See what happens, see what inspires you. Because something will come out of these. I will then go away and take one element maybe, of, of probably do this again. Um, I'll take one element of this and put it into another pour. And that is what creativity is all about. I hope it inspires you. Bye for now.